Hello, I'm John Logan. I live across the street and uh, anytime I'm passing, if the gallery is open, I come in. And uh, this is one of my favourite uh, works in the place. It's not the most brilliant of paintings by any means, uh, but uh, it resonates with a lot of Limerick and specifically its history. I like in particular the way in which it captures this whole seg segment of Limerick working life. It's painted probably in the 1820s, and uh, it's probably the first representation that I know of what seems to me to be a boat club, and I'm very keen on St. Michael's boat club, so this connects for me straight away. They're all in uniform, and they have a cot. The guys here with their turf boat are bringing turf down, probably from County Clare, and they're about to deliver it into the distillery here on Brown's Key. And that's confirmed by the fact that the boat, you won't be able to see it, but the boat is actually Brown's, and it's owned by Brown's. And most important of all, the people who kept the city going, the women who are taking water out, this is long before there's piped water, uh, who are washing, washing themselves perhaps, washing clothes, and carting with the tubs of water on their heads, bringing it off. I could have picked any one of these works, but why did I pick this one? Um, first of all, it's probably because of the artist, I think, more so than the picture. It's by Harry Kernoff, and we have three works by him in the collection here. So he liked to paint the urban, the industrial, Guinness's brewery workers, dockers, people in pubs. In some sense, he's a he's he's an urban response in some ways to Sean Keating at a time of severe uh, fuel rationing. And he went down to the bogs. He painted the turf being cut, and he painted quite a few versions of this. But there's another little twist to it. He was very interested in maybe even passionate about a woman called Delia Murphy, who at the time was probably Ireland's best known person abroad, uh, at least as popular as John McCormick. She was a recording artist. Uh, Delia Murphy's character, her, her vivaciousness, he's very taken by that, and I think he gets it into the picture very well. 